and it has some... There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Emergency food rations. Awesome. Now, are you going to be trying these? Oh, God, no. <laughs> I, I think it would be a good idea to do like a three-day challenge where you're just eating those. It's oh. a great diet plan. It's... But then I would lose what I have okay. <laughs> for my emergency. I, well, fortunately, I, I, I just placed an order, so I have some coming in the mail so I could replenish it. You know, if you really want me to do it, I would do it. You hear that, guys? I would do it. <laughs> it's time for a very special edition of the Emergency Food Ration Bar Challenge. For the next 72 hours, Tactical Temptress is going to be attempting to eat the same May Day Emergency Food Ration Bars that I recently challenged. And she thinks it's not going to be that difficult, so... Nah. So for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, uh, she's going to be eating these bars, and I'm going to leave all the camera equipment over here at uh, the Tactical Temptress Estate, and she's going to go for it. So, <laughs> any, uh... I'm excited. I, I don't think it's going to be that hard. So we shall see. So let's get started with this special video featuring the Emergency Food Ration Bar Challenge with Tactical Temptress. Get ready. All right, I'm breaking into the Mayday bars. This is a two pack, or two day pack, uh, 24 calorie one. So I have two of these. I'll probably have to break open both, though I might try to do 800 calories a day. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see. Wow, this looks good. <laughs> <laughs> it looks great. Mm -hmm. And. Oh, the sound of that is just it's delicious. It's bringing back nightmares yeah, for you. Yeah, it is bringing back nightmares. <laughs> I'm really glad that someone else is doing this except for me. Wow, it really is crumbly. Look at that. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So you're going to pack them individually in the yes. sandwich bags? Yes. And one for each meal then? Yeah. <laughs> <Okay>. Yes. <laughs> All right, I'll let you get to it. Hey, Prepper, do you want a bite? You, you want a bite, bite, buddy? Yeah. You going to make some camera time? Apparently he loves them. Gotta be good. <laughs> good morning, YouTube. This is day one of my challenge. Oh boy. So, <laughs> I was thinking overnight that the Urban Prepper, he's a big guy. And to have him do a 1200 calorie bar for a day probably was a struggle, though he might have been adding a little drama for the camera. I don't know. I was teasing him about that. So I thought in order to really have a fair competition, challenge, I might reduce my calorie intake by only having two squares instead of three, like he did. Reducing my calorie intake into 800, two bars. So what I did, I have my, my bars to Four, and then I took today's bars and I cut them up into halves and quarters. So I basically have three quarters of a bar in each one of these bags. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. I'm going to bring along an extra third bar just in case so I can still get the full 1200 calorie intake if I want it, if I feel like I need it. Oops. But I'm going to try. And it looks like that's the one I'm going to eat first. So here you can see bar and roughly a quarter of the bar. Looks good. Here we go. It's actually really good. It's nutty, sweet, kind of vanilla-y and cinnamon, very powdery, very dry, definitely want to have a lot of water, but not bad. We'll see if I say the same thing in three days. Just has crumbs. It's good. 
So, you see the first day, part one, bag number two with three quarters of a bar for lunch. I don't really need to pack this because I'm probably going to eat it back here for dinner, but I'm packing it anyways. Bag number three for dinner. And just in case I can't handle it, I am packing a full square, which would make a full three days, 1200 calorie diet, just in case. And I'll let you know by the end of the day whether or not I use that. And that's my lunch and dinner. <laughs> for the day. Thanks. The Urban Prepper and I use a website called myfitnesspal.com to track our daily food intake. I found it to be really useful to see how much uh, food I take in for breakfast, for lunch, for dinner that I don't necessarily think about, the snacks that I have in the course of the day. So I really enjoyed this to keep me accountable. And on a whim, I thought I'd type in Mayday Bar to see if it was in the database, thinking there was no way, and it is. It actually is in, the, in their database of food to consume for the day. So I have my day's food already accounted for, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Now I put out the three full bars. Again, I might not have all of that, but you can see it totals it up to 1,200 calories. And I'm over the limit for my carbs for the day. I'm over the limit for the fat content for the day. Protein, I still have plenty of room. And sodium, there's practically none. And sugar, it's I'm maxed. I have no more sugar opportunities. Not that I'm going to be eating anything else, but it gives you a little bit of idea of what's in this bar. So, just for fun, thought I'd show it to you. Thanks. Hey, YouTube. It's 2 o'clock. My day has been jam-packed with meetings. I'm supposed to be on another one in just ay, six minutes. So I guess it's a good thing I don't have much to eat because <laughs> I'll get through it very quickly. So here's my lunch. It's really good. I really don't have any complaints about this, other than it, there's not much of it, but it tastes good. I like drinking a lot of water, so that's not a problem for me. And so, so far, so good. I'm hungry, uh, but who wouldn't be hungry at two o'clock? So there you go. All right, last bite. I just have some crumbs. Hey, YouTube. It's the end of day one, and I just got home, and I'm about to devour my third uh, meal, if you want to call it that. It's really good. I was hungry mm, pretty quickly after I ate lunch. And I've been hungry most of the day. But I have not suffered in any way. I don't feel like it was hard to get through the day. Felt pretty good. And in fact, I went to the gym, hence the wardrobe. Um, so, so far so good. And here's the last bite. Yum!